Katie Price looked elegant in a navy bridesmaid dress as she arrived at her sister Sophie's wedding on Tuesday after reportedly begging her to bring the ceremony forward ahead of her sentencing for breaching a restraining order. The former glamour model, 44, cut an uncharacteristically demure figure in the gown and clutched a pretty flower bouquet as she made her way to the Sussex church to watch mother of one Sophie wed Harry Brooks. Katie was joined by her kids Harvey, 20, Junior, Princess, 14, Bunny, 7, and Jet, 8, for the family wedding as well her mother Amy Price and her partner Paul. Katie looked lovely in her navy dress which had a flattering off-the-shoulder design and clung to here figure before falling into the full-length skirt. The star wore her honey locks in perfectly styled waves over her shoulders and opted for a typically glamorous makeup look as she posed for pictures outside the church with her family. To her mother's. Meanwhile her daughter Princess looked sweet in a similar navy dress which had a sparkly top section and chiffon skirt and was teamed with silver heels while she wore her hair in a similar curly style. Harvey looked smart for the church ceremony and wore a white shirt and bright red tie as he held onto his mother's arm while walking along the pavement. Meanwhile Bunny looked adorable in her navy dress and had a pretty flower headband in her hair she held a matching bunch in her hand. Jet matched all of his siblings and mother in his sweet navy suit and white shirt as he made his way to the church with his family in tow. Katie's mother Amy, who suffers from a terminal lung condition, looked bright in a yellow maxi dress and carried her oxygen tank with her into the church. The bride looked stunning in her sweeping white gown and veil as she headed to the church before posing for snaps with her husband and baby. Sophie and fiancé Harry, who have been together for 12 years, welcomed their son Albert last September. Katie took to Instagram on Wednesday to share a glimpse at her sister's nuptials to Harry as she appeared to be enjoying the big day. She shared an array of video clips to her Instagram stories of her children dancing and singing as they appeared to have the time of their lives at the reception. One clip showed Katie taking a selfie before panning over to her daughter Princess, who she shares with her ex Peter Andre, as she enjoyed a tasty snack. Another video showed Princess taking to the dance floor with her younger sibling Bunny, who Katie shares with her ex Kieran Haler. Other footage shared to the mother of Five's Instagram grid saw her son Junior dancing and singing along to his debut single Slide with Bunny. The sweet clip saw the brother and sister nailing coordinated dance moves as Junior belted out the track, which hit the number one spot on the UK iTunes pop chart. The glimpse inside Sophie's wedding came after it was reported that Katie begged her sister to push up her nuptials by two days as she is due to appear in court on Friday. A source told The Sun that the close-knit family were desperate to spend Sophie's wedding together and moved up the ceremony after Katie was warned she faces jail. They added, Katie looked proud as punch as they arrived at the church smiling for the cameras and nothing like a woman who could be living in a cell in two days' time. Katie even brought a film crew along with her, typically, so she's obviously not too alarmed. But she was hell-bent on being at Sophie's wedding and they've been enjoying quality time together in the build-up. Mail Online has contacted Katie's representatives for comment. Katie was joined by her children at the wedding but it was previously reported that her fiancé Carl Woods was not allowed to attend the ceremony. Sophie, who got engaged to her partner Harry in March, reportedly refused to include Katie's fiancé Carl due to his on-off relationship with Katie as well as issues with Harry. According to The Sun, Katie was hoping that Sophie would let Carl attend after threatening behavior charges against Carl were dropped. A source said, 
Katie really hoped Carl would be able to come to the wedding and Sophie would change her mind but the guest list is already finalized and she respects her sister's wishes. She doesn't want anything distracting from Sophie's big day and she knows it's not about her or Carl. Katie will be there with a big smile on her face to celebrate her sister. But of course it makes her sad to not have Carl by her side. As for Carl, he's disappointed too but more for Katie's sake. He understands, however, and wishes Sophie and Harry all the best for their big day. The publication reported that Sophie and Harry tied the knot at a church in West Sussex not far from Katie's home on Wednesday. Sophie confirmed her engagement in March, writing on Instagram, Well I didn't expect that round the fire pit last night. I said yes.